Hi, back at Erie IGA. Uh, we want to show you the new new machine that we have to offer. This is the Passmo S520. This is the floor model. Um, this machine is very high tech, very good. It's the best one we've had to offer yet. This this is a awesome high quality machine. You'll notice that it has stainless steel handles. They're self returning. Um, with this, you also you, you have the setup. To, to do all kinds of settings inside here. Let me show you over here. Let me show you over here. Well, we're gonna turn on this. This is auto. Hit that first, then hit your prequel. I like the prequel because this sets this hopper to 40 degrees. Keeps that ice, keeps that ice cream or yogurt cool so you don't have to worry about it ever going bad. Even at the end of the night, when you turn it off, go ahead and hit that pre-cool button again and you won't have to worry about it being bad when you come in in the morning. It'll all be set and ready to go again, and then you just have to auto on and ready to go. Uh, this machine can put out 50 liters an hour. That's like one ice cream cone every 30 seconds, so you should never have an issue with that. Uh, it's two individual systems on here. It's a double system. With Each one can be ran as, is ran separately. You don't have to run one. Say you don't have the ice cream mix for that side, and you don't want to have to clean just the one side at the end of the or in the middle of the day you can go ahead and turn that one off until you get the new mix it's ready to go each side has also let me show you over here is two separate setups if you'll notice there's two different compressors and condenser units everything's separate there's also a separate one for your pre-cooling system uh, if you look here we have a power inverter this allows you to work with 220 240, 208, any of those can be ran off this. What it does is it steps the, the power down because if you'll notice, there are no belts in this system. This system is a, is a gear, geared system and therefore you don't have to ever have to worry about changing a belt on it. Uh, it's, it's really quiet. What it does is this sets it down, starts it at a lower speed, and then gradually builds it up so that your noise is reduced completely. You don't ever have a loud machine. Uh, You'll notice there's two separate fans, each one for the coolest for each, each side. Uh, you'll notice also that we have just this, each one has its own individual motor for the agitators. The agitator does have a belt on it, it's heavy duty, it's small, you'll probably never ever have to re replace that for the life of the machine. The agitators inside, notice, are really easy to take off and, and clean, really nice setup, they're big wide agitators, does a really good job and a stainless steel tube. That's a good thing because you don't have to worry about any of that plastic stuff starting to mold and everything else. Stainless steel is good to go. Um, what else do we have that I want to show you real quick on this machine? Uh, uh, on the back, you can see that you can, you've got the CE, you get the UTL, all US certification or ETL, ETL certifications, you got the CE, everything that the U.S. requires, it's already on here. It's U.S. inspected, it's ready to rock. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, again, over here, let me show you. It's gonna take seven minutes. It make. takes seven minutes to, to make ice cream. So when you get in in the morning, it's already on standby because you set your pre-cooler to go for, uh, for your ice cream hopper, keeping it at 40 degrees so that you didn't waste your ice cream. So in the, in the morning when you come in, you hit that auto, Seven minutes later, you're ready to roll on your ice creams. As I said, two individual systems. Two individual systems here. The uh, trays are set up really nice. It has its drain. Drains set up, I, I should have explained that. It's, it's set up to where there's no leakage. In, you know, on some machines you had leaks in the back and all this other. The way this is set up, it separates the air to the to the water and then if there's any reason it'll it'll turn around and shoot that water down and in the well not shoot but it'll it'll drain that water right down in here with no problems uh what else did i want to tell you about this machine we'll we have the, each liter each one is 12 and a half liters big uh we'll wait seven minutes and in seven minutes we'll show you this we'll move, go ahead and we'll come back in just a second all right, we're back. If you can see now, it says ready. Well, it said ready for a second there. Uh, it's ready for you to dispense. When the mix gets low, the low light will come on, it'll blink and it'll beep at you, and the machine will shut down to let you know that you're low on mix. Um, 
I also want to touch on before I forget, inside here are the beaters. I have a uh, one over here from this other machine that I can show you. They're, they're 304 stainless steel and they're easy breakdown. They're easy breakdown, you know, you can clean it. To make, clean it is so simple. You know, you slide that out to clean it. You turn around and you slide this piece off or pop this piece off. It goes right on there. And you, you don't have to worry about cleaning is easy. Grade 304, even the hoppers are. I'm even, the temperature for the hoppers. Too. Even the hopper is 304 stainless steel. Uh, and it's ETL, like I stated earlier. Uh, and and uh, again, I can't go over it too, you, enough that the fact that you can hit that pre cooler and at 40 degrees, you keep your ice cream good right there. That is a 2%. So if you see, it's at 2 degrees right now two Celsius, Celsius yeah. which is, you know, three to right. Four. Now I'm going to show you here as it comes out. It should say ready up there. It's coming out, nice soft serve. Ice cream we have in here is uh, honey. honey yogurt right now. Really good, really good ice cream or yogurt. Um, you will get a book with it. Really nice book. Explains everything. Uh, like I said, the only thing it doesn't explain is how to do some of the programming. That's because inside here, it's already programmed the way you need it to go. Okay. If for some reason, I mean, you shouldn't have to mess with it at all, but if for some reason you decide, oh, uh, I, I want mine harder or I want mine softer, there's a way to do it by coming in and holding down the button. We will give you. And then using this to up and down the, the, but we'll give you a printout with your machine that explains how to do that. Again, I, I, I stress you don't need to do that. If for some reason you do, you know, it will give you a printout on how to do it. Uh, again, it's two separate systems. You can run vanilla, chocolate, strawberry, chocolate, whatever you want inside here. And then this mixes it as a twist. It comes out really good and really soft. You'll see this here. Good. Thank you. Again, enjoy the Pasmo 520 ice cream yogurt machine.